Kirabioto, and that is, how are you in the language of Maasai? Greetings from... These are all the cows of the Maasai. To ask him about his life as a, a shepherd here in uh, the village. Eti maisha ya apa ya biashara. Irabioto, and that is, how are you in the language of Maasai? Greetings from Kisongo here in the Arusha region in Tanzania. This is a Maasai village area here in Arusha and today we'll be checking it out together. My guide Ali is here with me and he'll be showing me around. Ali, uh, you know, greet the audience out there around the world. Yeah, yeah we're going in Maasai, Nani, Maasai Poma there. In around you, we're going to walk and to see a lot of Maasai and to say hi in Maasai. It's like Irabioto, uh, Ekenwa, Eti, Eti Wawalai, Sidai, Sidai Toko. Thank you, thank you so much. So, guys, thank you so much for watching Inspire for Travel. And if you're new to the channel, do consider liking, sharing, and subscribing to the channel by clicking on the red box below this video that says subscribe. Let's explore Kisongo. So we're currently walking through the village here in Kisongo and you'll mainly find the people of the Maasai community living in this area. So we get a real feel of the place today. Mm. This. Mm. Now one of the things you'll notice about Arusha, it rains a lot. So, yeah. So you are seeing some of the after effects of the rain here on the road. It's, it's a dirt road. So usually when it rains, this is what it looks like. So here is like a market area? A market area of Maasai. Of the Maasai, yeah. okay. So it's a basic setup. Not many people are out today, but you can see they use wooden structures to put their goods on. So this is a very important uh, animal, these cows, in the Maasai culture. And today I've met some shepherds here in the village. And um, they're going to tell us a little bit about what they do. I'm going to talk to you about the Maasai. I'm going to talk to you about the Maasai. I'm going to talk to you about the Maasai. I'm going to talk to you about the Maasai. They say now the masses they live another place as are they here and they don't have that culture to keep in any well to to hold that culture do you know Ma Maasai Shuka? Yes the Maasai yeah. uh, clothes that they usually wear the red one because the Swahili is here okay and they change as a Maasai to 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 get another clothes okay and but other they live here and the, that, this cows 
and they live here in Maasai. This is Kisongo. Do you know Kisongo? Kisongo, yeah. yeah. I was told this is Kisongo. They have well, another culture there of that house of Maasai that was make of salt. Okay. Yeah. And he can try to continue okay. to talk. So, so that, that's very interesting. You can see because they have moved to a new place, they have kind of changed the dress code, but you can see they're still involved in their traditional work of looking after the cows and grazing from different places. So that's very interesting. Yeah. Could you ask him how long has he been doing the, 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 this uh, work? Kuchunga. Yeah. Kuchunga kwa sasa hivi kulinga yani niongee Kiswahili Masai yeah, Masai ya gelo gumbo kwa hiyo tena kata ata paka saa sita kama ata ngure gumbo kwa kana wapi gumbo kwa kumi mto tangu gumbo kwa paka saa sita ni kwenye nani bule desa tisa yuko online bob bob ni siku ya dola letiwa tayari ni nani dola Okay. They say here is safe end the eleven and then they go to home to eat to and then he can return here to continue of this work of the cows and the all the at night of mm -hmm. at, at 10, 10 or 11, he's going to back, he's to turn this, this cow to home. Okay. Yeah. So, nyumbani yako, nyumbani yako ni wapi? Nyumbani kwetu ni mbele kidogo, mbele kidogo pale. Aha. Kwa hiyo, tumakuja kukuzungisha, kuzungisha maana watu ni kama majirani, tumana kwetu ni mbele kidogo. Kwa mbele mti kwa mbele. Okay. Kule? Mm. Oh, very far. Okay. <laughs> All right. Mwana asante sana kuwangea leo. So what you're witnessing right now, it's the part we're leading towards the various Maasai villages. And usually people would walk or get the border border to to go to the Kijiji or the Boma, yeah. Kijiji means village in Kiswahili. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Bush. A lot of greenery here. A lot of Maasai prefer to maintain their traditional way of living and their traditional culture here in Tanzania. However, you did see one of the things the, one of the shepherds was saying is that they do change their dress code depending on where they're going. So sometimes you'll see some of them wearing their traditional red clothing and sometimes they're just wearing normal clothing. Wanawake wa Masai? Yeah. Uh, so these... Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you see, these are Masai women we're coming up to. But like uh, my guide Ali is saying, some of them started to incorporate the dressing just like other women in Tanzania, Swahili clothing. And the language I'm here, they're, they're speaking, they're speaking in Swahili, not Maasai, you know. So these are some of the changes you, you're seeing in some of the villages in Tanzania, Maasai villages. Funny enough, this used to be, Ali, is this a, a river? river? Yeah. Right, but you can see it's dried up. Some of the things you're noticing because of the climate change, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. They're talking Maasai. They're speaking in Maasai. Yeah. 
shikamo bwana uh, habari ya leo yes. uh, so leo utakwenda wapi naenda madukani madukani eh? so unafanya kazi katika madukani eh naofanya kazi kidogo tu okay. kusaidia watoto okay. biashara gani eh akusa gongo Okay. Okay. Alcohol. Alcohol. Oh, gongo. Okay. So habari za sokoni siku hizi? Si nzuri kabisa kesho ndio kuna sokoni huko. Okay. Yeah. Leo ninakuja hapa kwa kusudi uh, kujifunza Masai utamiduni. So you know Masai utamiduni siku hizi. How is it vipi? Eh, nzuri siku hizi inaendelea vizuri siku hizi. Nzuri eh. Yeah. Okay. Sawa na ujaribu kuja siku zingine kuja kuja huko. Okay. Tembea tembea huko. Asante sana bwana. Asante. Nakuta wengine pia na wewe. Nzuri. Habari bwana. Nzuri tu. Yeah, so unafanya kazi sokoni pia? Eh. Okay, sawa. Eh, naanza kabichi na nyanya na kitungu. Kitungu? Mm. Ah, okay, sawa, sawa. Unaitwa nani? Naitwa Paula. Paula. Mm. Wewe ni Masai? Ni Masai. So una unaongea Masai? Naongea kabisa. Kabisa. Mm. Okay, so Nataka kumwambia karibu akinasema mm. Eh, yeah, so Unaitwa tu karibu. Karibu. Eh, yeah, karibu. Yeah, karibu so... wa wale. Wa wa wale. Wa wale. Yeah. Okay. Habari katika Masai? Ka, nzuri tu. Ka, nzuri tu. Mm, nzuri kabisa. Okay, asante sana bwana. Haya. Haya. Asante. Yeah. These are all the cows of the Maasai. Uh, yeah. Okay, that is good. Now.